talk about just taking all those three pointers and just having them go in and just ha having it all on you guys. At least got to have the confidence to shoot the ball. So the coach told us a lot of them weren't going in for me in the first half, but he just told me to keep shooting and the shots will eventually go in, and they did. So. You were down six at the end of the third. What was coach's message for the fourth? And obviously, you must have said something right. He just he said we're still in this. Like it's not over until buzzer sounds like RJ said. So we just got to keep playing hard and a lot of energy. That's I think that's what helped us. Going against a guy like Hayden Skank, what do you do against a guy like that? How, how are you able to be effective against him? He's a, he's a really good player. So we just had our best defender, Trevor. We had him guard him. And we tried to gap him at first, but he knocked down some threes. So we just we just had to play our best D and hope that, you know, I guess, I mean, you can't really stop a guy 100% like that, but just try our best to do what we can. Free throws were huge for you guys down the stretch. You guys just didn't seem nervous, the raucous crowd and all that. Just talk about how much you guys were just in those final shots. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Did you guys hear the crowd? I think, I think you hear them in the back of your mat, in the back of your mind, but you try not to focus on it. Just focus on the shot and just knock it down. Were you guys worried at all that you guys might lose this game? No, we don't. I don't think we ever worry that we're going to lose a game. Because if, if you go into a game thinking you're going to lose, I think you will lose. So just go in thinking you're going to win and try your best. What do you guys got to prepare for next game? Uh, we, uh, we played them earlier in the season, so we just got to play the same way we did then, and I think we'll be fine.